It was an event 200 years in the making, but in the end, the crowds came away impressed with the War of 1812 reenactment east of Thamesville on Saturday. Years of planning and a week's worth of events culminated with the battle that resulted in the loss of Chief Tecumseh. Bill Wan played one of the British soldiers on the battlefield. Oh, this is a lot of fun. We, we do this as a hobby, but it's, uh, it's more like a passion for a lot of people, and it's really, it's really interesting to get here and, and, um, and just see the countryside and, and experience some of the history that happened in this area. Gerth Purdy took part and says the best they could do was die with honor. We participated with the other militia and fired off our muskets towards the Americans and then we got encircled by the cavalry, so we died. The marching soldiers in period clothing and charging horses proved to be an exciting outing for those in attendance. We really enjoyed it. Really good, yes, yeah. yes, we Very really good. good. That was uh, enjoyable. The day turned out to be nice and uh, really enjoyed it. thought it was fantastic. It was great. It was very interesting. Yep. Really enjoyed it. Uh, just 200 years. Wow, it's pretty amazing that this happened right here 200 years ago. Just like 200 years ago, the Americans defeated the British and native troops at the Battle of the Thames during the War of 1812. There are still a few events taking place, like the dig in Tecumseh Park. As well, the ringing of the Fairfield Bell will take place Sunday morning. Trevor Thompson, BlackburnNews.com.